Hi, in this factorization question, uh, this is a bit interesting here. What we are asked to do is, we are asked to substitute u equals to x cubed into this expression over here. Alright, um, so let's see, uh, I'll rewrite this expression. x to the power of 6 minus 7x cubed minus 8. So what uh, we are supposed to do is, take u equals to x cubed and substitute into this expression here. So the first thing we have to do is to uh, make sure that in this expression we can see the x cubed terms clearly and uh, we can actually achieve that by factorizing or using the indices rule over here. The indices rule that we're going to use is am to the power of n is am times n. So x to the power of 6 is actually can be written as x to the power uh, uh, can be written as x to the power of 3 bracket 2 right 3 times 2 will be 6 so that is what I'm going to be uh, writing over here x cube whole thing square minus 7x cube minus 8 so now we can see the x cube and x cube uh, very clearly and we can rewrite this expression as u square minus 7u minus 8. So once we are able to do this, the next part of the question, which is to solve this expression, becomes easy because uh, right now what you have is no longer in very high powers like x power 6, x power 3. What you see here is actually a very simple quadratic expression. All right, quadratic expression. So in order to factorize this, all right, uh, so x to the power of 6 minus 7x cubed minus 8 equals to 0 can actually now be rewritten x u to the power u square minus 7u minus 8 equals to 0. Now we can factorize this using the cross or box method, all right, whichever uh, approach that you feel comfortable with. So u and u would give me u square. All right. Uh, 8 and 1 would give me 8. Right. I know I want a negative 8, but we'll come back to that in a bit. Uh, u times 8 gives me 8u. u times 1 will give me u. Uh, what I want over here is negative 7u. In order to get a negative 7, it must be negative 8 plus 1. So this is I put a negative uh, here I put a negative here and this is a positive so negative times positive would be negative 8 which is also what I see here so what we have now is this factorized will be equals to uh, u minus 8 and u minus 1 uh, u plus 1 equals to 0 so that leaves us with u minus 8 equals to 0 and u plus 1 equals to 0. u equals to 8, u equals to minus 1. Now we know that we started off by using this substitution. So right now what we need to do is we need to substitute back u as x cubed equals to 8 and x cubed equals to minus 1. So x is the cube root of 8 which is 2 and the other solution is the cube root of minus 1 is minus 1. Okay, so the two answers for this uh, factorization, factorization question is x equals to 2 and x equals to minus 1. Alright, so I hope uh, this video has given you a good idea how to solve this type of questions. Uh, the basic thing is, the first part is uh, substitution. So as long as the substitution is done correctly, you will see that a... Uh, an equation that looks complex is, is now reduced to a very simple quadratic expression from which you can then factorize and then substitute back at the end to get the final answer. Alright, thank you for watching and I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye.